Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Our third lecture is the stress in time management. It's uh, semester one. Time management. First we will discuss time management, then we will discuss stress management. What is time management? Actually, time management refers to managing time effectively, efficiently, so that the right time is allocated to the right activity. Number two, Effective time management allows individuals to assign specific time slots to activities as per their importance. Third, time management refers to making the best use of time as time is always limited. And fourth, time management plays a very important role not only in organization but also in our personal Time management includes effective planning, number two, setting goals and objectives, three, setting deadlines, four, delegation of responsibilities, fifth, prioritizing activities as per their importance, sixth, spending the right time on the right activity. Effective planning. Plan your day well in advance. Prepare to do list or a task plan. Break down the important activities that need to be done in a single day against the time that should be allocated to each activity. High priority work should come on top, followed by those which do not need much of your importance at the moment. Complete pending tasks one by one. Do not begin fresh work unless you have finished your previous task. Pick the ones you have already completed. Ensure you finish the task within the stipulated time frame. Setting goals and objectives. Working without goals and target as an organization would be similar to the situation where the captain of the ship loses his way in the sea. Yes, you would be lost. Set targets for yourself and make sure they were they are realistic ones and achieve. Setting deadlines. Set deadlines for yourself and strive hard to complete tasks ahead of the deadlines. Do not wait for your supervisor to ask you every time. Learn to take ownership of work. One person who can best set the deadlines is you, yourself. Ask yourself how much time needs to be devoted to a particular task and for how many days. Use a planner to mark the important dates against the set deadline. Delegation of responsibility. Learn to say no at workplace. Don't do everything on your own. There are other people as well. One should not accept something which he knows is difficult for him. The roles and responsibilities must be delegated as per interest and specializations of employees for them to finish tasks within the deadlines, a person who doesn't have knowledge about something needs more time than someone who knows the work well. Prioritizing task. Prioritize the task as per their importance and urgency. Know the difference between important and urgent work. Identify which task should be done within a day, which all should be done within a month, and so on. Tasks which are most important should be done earlier. Spending the right time on the right activity. Develop the habit of doing the right thing at the right time. Work done at the wrong time is not of much use. Don't waste 
a complete day on something which can be done in an hour or so. Also keep some time separate for your personal calls or check it updates on Facebook or Twitter. After all, human being is not a machine. Effective time management one needs to be number one organized. Avoid keeping lots of files and plenty of paper at your workstation. Throw what all you don't need. Put important documents in folders. Keep the files in their respective drawers with labels on top of each file. It saves time which goes on unnecessary searching. Number two, don't misuse time. Don't kill time by delaying or gossiping around. Concentrate on your work and finish assignment on time. Remember, your organization is not paying you for playing games on computer or twittering into others for place. First, complete your work and then do whatever you feel like doing. Don't wait till the last moment. Number three, be focused. One needs to be focused for effective time management. Develop the habit of using planners, organizers, tabletop, calendars for better time management. Set reminders on phones or your personal computers. Time management techniques. Time management techniques refers to the careful use of time for achieving success in life. Time management helps an individual to take the best possible use of time. It is essential for individuals to value time and allocate the right time to the right activity. Set your priorities. Know what all needs to be done on an urgent basis. Prepare a to-do list or a task plan. We jot down tasks you need to complete against the time slot assigned to each activity. High priority tasks must be written on top followed by tasks which can be done a little later. Make sure you stick to your task list. Make sure you finish your assignments within the stipulated time frame. Take the task you have already finished. Treat yourself with a chocolate if you finish your assignments ahead of deadlines. Understand the difference between urgent and important work. Manage your work well. Do not begin your day with something which is not so important and can be done a little later. First, finish off what all is urgent and important. Do not wait for your boss members. Stay focused. Don't let leave your workstation if some urgent work needs to be done. Going for strolls in the middle of an urgent work breaks continuity and an individual tends to lose his focus. Individuals who kill time at work find it difficult to survive workplace stress. Do include time for your tea breaks, net surfing, personal calls and so on in your daily schedule. It is important human being is not a machine who can work at a stretch for 8 or 9 hours, assign half an hour to 45 minutes to check updates on social networking sites. Call your friends or family or go for smoke breaks, etc. Set realistic and achievable targets for yourself. Know what you need to achieve and in what duration. 
do not lie to yourself, assigning one half to a task which you yourself know would require much more time does not make sense. Do not overburden yourself. Say a firm no to your boss. If you fail, you would not be able to complete a certain assignment within the assigned deadline. Don't worry, he will not feel bad. Probably, he can assign the same to any of your fellow workers except tasks which you are really confident about. Be disciplined and punctual. Avoid taking unnecessary leaves from work unless there is an emergency. Reach work on time as that helps you to plan your day better. Keep things at their proper places. File must be kept at their respective drawers. Staple important documents and put them in a proper folder. Learn to be a little organized. Learn to be a little more organized. It will save your time, which goes on unnecessary searching. Do not treat your organization as a mere source of money. Change your attitude. Avoid playing, playing games on computer or cell phones during office hours. It is unprofessional. Do not work only when your boss is around. Taking ownership of work pays you in the long run. Develop the habit of using an organizer. It helps you plan things better. Keep a notepad and a pen handy. Do not write contact numbers or email ideas on newspapers. You will waste half of your time searching them. Manage your emails. Create separate folders for each client. Do not clutter your desktop. Time management skills. The judicious use of time by an individual to succeed in all aspects of life refer to time management. Time management not only helps individuals to make the best use of time but also ensures successful accomplishment of tasks within the stipulated time frame. It is essential to do the right things at the right time to earn respect at work. People who do not value time fail to make a mark and are never taken seriously. Stay organized. The workstation must be kept clean and organized. Keeping important files organized help us retrieve them immediately and thus saves time which goes on unnecessary searching. Staple important documents together. Don't keep stacks of files and heaps of paper on your desk. Throw whatever you don't need. Keep stationary items and your personal belongings like cell phone, car keys, vault at their proper places. Develop the habit of using an organizer Plan your day well in advance. Never write on newspapers. Keep a notepad and pen handy. Thank you.